a special kind of plates we call chef plates, which you find here in this example. The chef plates are covering uh, wire boxes or glass boxes you have inside your aquarium and uh, they have not the same height. You see uh, this is 55 centimeter and this is 52 centimeters because we have the overflow inside the aquarium. We can fix it here and when we have a glass shaft inside, my, uh, inside our aquarium we can put the chef plate directly before. This is the back wall and this is the shaft and you see it looks like a real natural reef and you can cover the small sides with maybe back wall rocks which have a flat side. Uh, you can glue it directly on the glass or you can use some mortar and then you have uh, all these technical devices also covered really nice by reef ceramic plates. Well, now we're coming to the practical part, how we can build these back wall plates into our aquarium. Very helpful is a product which we call ceramic mortar. It's chemical different uh, to these material like reef ceramic, but the optic is nearly the same. When you use this one between two back wall plates or on the surface, and it looks like a natural reef, you can't see that, these, that you have more than one plate. It looks very, very good like one rock and uh, it, uh, it's very easy to use this. Well, sometimes you have not the right measurements um, and uh, how, how we can work with this porous material. The easiest way is a cutting machine like this here. Uh, you find it in many markets and it's very easy. Please have a look that you find some thin cutting disc. It's only one millimeter and it's uh, very easy to use and it goes very fast to have some cuts inside this material. When you don't have uh, something like this you can also take a normal saw and it's very easy. Uh, it takes a little bit longer time but uh, it goes very good. Uh, for breaking some reef structures on the front or on the side uh, you can use a normal tang like this here. You can move this a little bit and uh, go behind some material and can break it. It's very simple. When you absolutely want to use a hammer, please don't put the hammer on the material directly. Use something like this. Look for the right point and then make it a little bit safety. Well, for drilling uh, these materials, it's also simple. Use these drilling heads you can find uh, on the market. Uh, it goes very good because you have here uh, a stitch and you can uh, find the right point on your reef ceramic plate. It's very simple but please don't uh, do it um, inside your flat. Uh, take, uh, go outside, wash the material after uh, working and uh, it looks very very good and very helpful is the coral mortar. Well, not all aquarists uh, can or want work with all these tools uh, in their flat or want to work with a lot of mortar. But uh, sometimes uh, there is the possibility that the aquarium are not in the same measurements that we produce our standard uh, reef ceramic back walls. And then uh, you can have a look at the custom made back wall or custom made uh, structures. Uh, maybe the, the measurements are different or in this example we have uh, 90 degrees uh, uh, chef plate which is completely built in one piece. So there you see the advantage that your reef structures go around these 90 degree angles. So it's much more better than uh, glue two plates together. You can have some inbuilds for example here. Uh, high-tech aquarium pump, uh, uh, very powerful Aquabee 8000. You can build in directly and you have 
full power of the pump directly into the water, you have uh, no reducing by pipe systems and this is a big advantage uh, in making current and you see it looks very very well, you can't see the pump. So uh, it is not a big thing to do that, um, the prices are not so much higher to make something like this, we need only one week uh, so you don't have to wait uh, uh, too long for your special uh, custom made ceramic and uh, I think you have uh, seen some things that we can do for you and you have some ideas to work uh, inside your aquarium so uh, it's very funny to do that and uh, at the end the target looks very very well so when, I, uh, when you want to do that by yourself good luck for that and up to the next time thank you